Website speed is a confirmed Google ranking factor, and a one second delay in load time decreases conversions by 7%. According to Google, that one second delay is costing me $28,000 in lost profits this year. And if website speed doesn't have your attention yet, I suggest you run the numbers for your own business. Because in this video, I'm gonna share my completely free six step process to speed up your website. It's super easy for anyone to do and you don't need the help of a developer. Plus, I'll also be sharing some exclusive tips from my personal speed experiments at the end of this video. First, we need to get a benchmark of where we are right now in terms of our website speed. Now, the results of this might be shocking, but don't worry, we're gonna take care of everything together in a moment. First, capture data for your homepage and two other important pages in GT Metrics, Web Page Test, and Google Page Speed Insights. You can download a template from the full post on my blog to help you with that. But if you look at my results, you will see, well, I'm suffering from poor load times, large page sizes, high numbers of requests, and well, pretty rough page speed insight scores if I'm honest. But once we've got a baseline, we can start speeding things up. And the first thing that we're gonna do is install a caching plugin if you don't have one installed already. The easiest way to do that is with the free W3 Total Cache plugin. And if you need help setting it up, you can follow this excellent guide from WPMU Dev. Next, we need to optimize all of our images. You can often shave like 30 to 60% of image sizes using a free plugin like WP Smush. In just one click, it will automatically optimize all of your images. But I recently migrated to the Short Pixel plugin, which costs a bit of money, but took images I'd previously been compressed with WP Smush and compressed them by a further 46%. Once you've taken care of image optimization, it's time to lazy load all of our media. Now, if you're the type of person that hates the lazy load experience because it makes a page jump around randomly, well, don't worry, I hate that as well. But if you set up the Lazy Loader plugin like this and tick the Include Lazy Sizes Aspect Ratio plugin box, that will stop the page jumping around. Next, you should install Cloudflare, which is a free content delivery network that comes with a bunch of other performance enhancing features designed to speed up your website. Configuring this tool is a little beyond the scope of this video, so I'll refer you to this excellent tutorial from TTFB to get it set up. Once you've made all of those changes, it's time to test your site again. So head back over to GT Metrics, Web Page Test, and Google Page Speed Insights to repeat the test for each of your three URLs to see how much you have improved. And please leave a comment below to let me know your results. Remember, I had loads of problems with page size, requests, page speed scores, and a bunch of other stuff. But after deploying the ultimate setup for website speed that I'm gonna share with you in a minute, I was able to reduce average page size by 62%, reduce the number of requests by 59%, and reduce the average load time by 41%. Not only that, but page speed scores for mobile increased by 78% and desktop by 29%. All of those improvements were with this ultimate setup I'm gonna show you in a moment. But please be aware, you can make significant improvements to your website speed just by following the three six steps I already outlined. But if you're serious about increasing website speed, you need to invest a little bit of money. And I've spent a bunch of time testing different combinations of services and plugins on the blog. And the, the final combination I settled on was with WP Rocket, which has a ton of features that you don't get in W3 Total Cache, like combining and optimizing Google font files, all the way through to optimizing Google Analytics and your Facebook pixel. As you can see, it's jam-packed with a bunch of features that are all focused on making your website load faster. Next, I'm using ShortPixel to take care of image optimization. Remember, ShortPixel took images that had already been compressed with the free WP Smush plugin and then compressed them a further 46%. Those two plugins will do a lot of the heavy lifting for you, but your website speed starts with the foundation that your site is built on. And plugins can only get you so far. 
If you're paying less than $10 a month for your current host, your website is likely stuck on a server with thousands of other sites slowing you down. So you might want to consider changing your hosting. I recently built 18 sites on seven hosts to find out who is the best WordPress host. And surprisingly, the most expensive host was not the best host. Um, WPX hosting dominated my test across all categories while being one of the cheaper hosts that I tested. They also offer free migrations, which really takes the headache out of moving host and include a bunch of awesome features like uh, one-click backups, a staging site, free SSL, and an excellent CDN service. But moving host should only be done as a last resort. First, implement the free six-step process to speed up your website. If you want to go faster than that, invest in premium plugins like WP Rocket and ShortPixel. And if that doesn't satisfy your thirst for speed, change your host to WPX Hosting. Remember, you can use Google's tool to estimate how much money your slow website is costing you per year. Your website speed is paramount to the success of your business. Not only is it one of Google's official ranking factors, but it's one of your customers' ranking factors as well. Even a, a short delay could cost you thousands of dollars. But on the other hand, a small improvement could seriously increase your bottom line. So what are you waiting for? Your slow website is costing you money as we speak. So subscribe to my YouTube channel right now to get more great videos like this one, and then come back and leave a comment to let me know how much faster your website is right now.